All right, how about another AI update that has nothing to do with ChatGPT? Axelera has just released its new Europa line of AI acceleration chip. This one is built for edge devices. These are typically small devices that are run on premises, and we're gonna see a huge amount of this. In fact, uh, it's estimated that this is going to present the opportunity for billions of AI devices connected all over the world. And that right there is where AI is going to become hugely influential as if it's in these small devices put into places that most of us wouldn't expect it. Things like manufacturing facilities, um, your average business, your mom and pop local shop. If they can start running AI models locally, that's going to speed up work and AI will truly become the force multiplier that many of us think it is. Uh, the Associated Press actually just released a survey over the last couple of days where they polled a huge number of human beings and one of the number one things they are worried about with AI is the amount of energy it's using. And that personally, I believe is a massive problem. We should not be paying for this infrastructure. A brand new super PAC has come out with about $100 million worth of funding attempting to influence the 2026 midterm elections for AI-friendly candidates. Investors are adopting what is called a dot-com era playbook. I've been calling this one since in January of this year. It's the idea that AI is about to hit a bubble. I mean, if you are investing right now and you're heavily invested into AI, you definitely want to consider divesting and diversifying your funding because I think that bubble's about to burst or at bare minimum deflate just a little bit. Let me know what your thoughts are. I'd love to hear it down in the comments.